Oh man, I've been out here all day and I'm winded. I'm breathing quite heavily as you can see. And today, we're gonna learn about my breathing as we take an adventure through the respiratory system. enters the body. It can enter through the nostrils or the mouth. <sighs> Let's take a closer look at how air enters the body. Follow me. This is Luke's mouth. Air enters air can enter the body through the mouth as it will travel through the throat, which is behind the tongue. The second way air can enter the body is through your nose. These little hairs that you are seeing now are the hairs inside of Ethan's nostril. You may think they are gross, but they are actually quite helpful. They catch dust and debris and they only let clean air pass by. Now, if air enters the throat, which we are in now, it will go down to the trachea, but before the trachea, there is a little door, shall we say, called the epiglottis. The epiglottis prevents food or any obstructive objects from going down the trachea. And when it opens, it, let air, it lets air in and out. Let's go through the throat and take a closer look. We are now about to go down the trachea, or or the windpipe. This leads directly to the lungs. It's the only passageway oh my, to the lungs. It's dark. It is dark. Yes, it is dark down here. I'm kind of scared, actually. Oh, don't be a baby. Just go down it. I know it's the only way to the lungs, but down I just there. don't want to go. Jeez. Whoa. Luke's on his way down to the lungs, and so am I. Whoa. We whoa. Oh. Woo. We just got out of the trachea, that was thrilling. And now we are about to enter the lungs. The passageway to the left lung is here, and the passageway to the right lung is here. Follow me. We have just gotten out of the primary bronchi and now into the lungs. In the lungs is a bronchus, which subdivides into, into a tetriary bronchus, and then down to tiny bronchioles. We are now inside a bronchiole. The bronchiole's job is to supply air to the alveoli. Let's pass forward to the alveoli. We've just passed through the bronchioles, and now we are in the alveoli. The alveoli's job is to exchange oxygen and carbon dioxide. Let's take a look around. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> oh, interesting. Yes, indeed, indeed. Wow, that was a great trip through the respiratory system. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. The one thing that we didn't get to was the diaphragm. So I'm just going to explain to you what the diaphragm does. As you can see, when I take a breath in, my body goes up. That's because the diaphragm is pushing up on my lungs. As I breathe out, my body is going down. Let me show you one more time. That is because the diaphragm is pulling down on my lungs. Wow, that was a great trip. I, I really hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. Well, me and Luke are all proud to say that we have passed through the respiratory system. We'll see you next time.
Ethan, what is the function of the respiratory system? The function of the respiratory system is to transport gases to and from the cardiovascular system. Ethan, how does the respiratory system work? Well, oxygen can enter through either the nose or the mouth, as discussed earlier in this video. The air then travels down the trachea, which splits into two airways called the primary bronchi, one of which enters the right lung or the left lung. Each bronchus divides further into tiny bronchioles. At the tip of the bronchioles are air sacs called alveoli. Luke, what organs are included in the respiratory system? The organs included in the respiratory system are mouth, nose, lungs, and trachea. Luke, what is a disorder of the respiratory system? A disorder of the respiratory system is lung cancer. What happens to a person when they get this disorder? Well, if you have lung cancer, you cough up blood, you get severe chest pains, and you lose a lot of weight. So how does a person get this disorder? Well, the most common cause is smoking, and then secondhand smoke. Ethan, what? <laughs> Ethan, what is the function of the respiratory system? Go, baby! The function of the respiratory system... <laughs> Ethan, what is the function of the respiratory system? Ethan, what is the function of the respiratory system? The function of the respiratory system is to transfer... Luke, what organs are included in the respiratory system? The organ... <laughs> Each bronchus divides into further bronchioles. <laughs> Luke, what is the disorder of the respiratory... So, what happens to a person when they get this disorder? Well, if you get lung cancer, you cough up blood, you have... What do I say? You have wheezing? <laughs> So what happens to a person when they get this disorder? Well, <laughs> yeah. Hmm. So how do you get... <laughs>